Good morning to all my fellow artists. Um, I'm Lindy and I'm an emerging artist having uh, pretty much taken art on full time at a later stage in my life. There might be some of you out there who have got the same questions that I do and the question that I have today that is really burning is how do you remove the pencil marks once you've painted your canvas? Well, I've tried everything. I've tried trusty eraser. I've tried this eraser. I've tried all sorts of things, but nothing has worked. So instead of painting over those pencil marks, which I'm hoping I'm not going to have to do this time around, I'm going to show you something that I have tried that actually has worked for me. So what I've got here is a toothbrush. It's a soft toothbrush. I've got some dishwashing liquid and in this little cup here I've put a little bit of water and we're going to have a bit of a go with that. Now also I've got just a bit of a, a wet ones but it's actually dry because I've left it out overnight and I've got a q-tip and we're going to give that a go and see how it actually does work. So what I'll do is I'm just going to turn the camera around and I want to show you close up how the pencil marks actually look at the moment before we've had a go at them. So we'll just take you over to here and okay so I'm sure you can see pencil marks there. There were some up here and I've had a go at those so I'm pretty happy with that. Now there's a, a really good set of a couple that need to go and there's another one there and another one below up here up here up here down here so we're going to have a go at those ones and then I'm going to come back and show you how they actually look once we've got rid of the pencil marks and I'm back again doing some more scrubbing and I just wanted to show you but now that I've spent more than just two seconds doing it, I wanted to show you how effective it really is. Now, can you see there was all those pencil marks there that have virtually now all gone. So the only thing I did differently was I actually grabbed myself a wet, wet one for a change and rubbed over it first. And then I actually even though it's a soft to, uh, toothbrush, I did give it a bit more of a, a bit of elbow grease and again wiped it with the wet one. And <clears throat> I must add, look, it's, it does take a little bit of time, but when you have a background like this particular one, which I've got the pinks and the oranges graduating, yeah, it's still a bit soapy there, but you see that the colour is graduated. I really didn't want to have to tackle the thought of going back over it um, and trying to match those graduations which would have been a nasty horrible exercise considering how much work I've actually already done to the piece because there's not a chance in hell that I could have matched the colorings so really cleaning the pencil marks off was the only option for me so, you know, between a, a little block of soap that I have here as well as the dishwashing liquid and the uh, toothbrush, I, I didn't actually find that the Q-tip did as much good for me. I just want to show you also that I'm not getting really any colour coming off the canvas. It's just the soapy water. So I'm not, even though it might look at there, but that, oh no, see now it's dry and it's not shiny. So you can see that there's really nothing that's been left um, that's been taken off as far as the colour of the, the background. So here we go over some black paint. Oh, sorry, I didn't realise I didn't have you in there. And we're just scrubbing away. I'm just going to grab a bit more of my soapy water on my toothbrush here. And you can see, as I'm doing it, in real time, how effective it really is. And it's not removing any of the artwork that I had done it really is just getting my pencil marks and I've decided that you know this is 
not a it was scary to start with because I thought, oh my God, I'm going to make my paint work. I mean, I know that it's acrylic and it's not going to reactivate and all that sort of thing. Um, but I was a little nervous, I have to be honest, about attacking my artwork with a toothbrush and soap. Um, but really, it's not as scary as, as you might think. Um, just do it. You know, what's the worst thing that can happen? If you're going to ruin it, well, that's a shame, terrible shame um, for all the work we've put into our artworks. But by the same token, it's nothing that can't be fixed. You can just put a, a layer of paint over the top and start again. It's not like you've totally ruined um, the canvas because you haven't. And that's actually something that I've also uh, taken on board when I do paint, that if worse comes to worst and it's absolutely horrible, I don't like it or whatever, um, just go over it. Take the risk. You might be happy with what you find. And um, yeah, why not? So there you go. I really do hope because it's something that, um, that I've absolutely tackled and had to repaint things over the top because I couldn't get rid of the pencil marks, not realising that I could actually just wash the canvas and uh, get those pencil marks gone. So if you have found this helpful, I'd love to get a thumbs up and um, have a happy day painting. Thank you.